Hi everyone, Adam with eTrailer.com. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Yakima Jetstream roof rack system on our 2019 Kia Sorento. So this is going to come in handy whenever you're on those trips. You have a lot of people in your car and they have a lot of cargo. You can put all that up here on our roof rack. We have a lot of different accessories here at eTrailer.com. This does have a T-Track, so any T-Track accessory is going to work with these bars. It's always nice going on a trip where everybody's got enough room to lay out and just enjoy the ride. And whether it's a roof cargo basket, a cargo carrier, we have a couple bikes up there, maybe even a couple fishing poles. Whatever it may be, these bars are going to be able to store all that for you, leaving all of the space on the inside of your car. So these Jetstream bars are going to have a aerodynamic look to them. As well, it's going to help with that wind noise. A lot of those round and square bars do have a decent amount of drag going down the road, but how these are designed, it's kind of like a airplane. So it's going to go through the air a lot better. We do have a little cover that goes over these bars. It's going to cut down on those wind noises even more. So check out eTrailer.com for that. On top of that, it is going to have a 165 pound weight capacity. It is made of a very lightweight aluminum with a nice powder coated finish so it's going to resist against rust and corrosion and last quite a long time. We do have two different colors available. We have the black right here. We also have a silver color option on eTrailer.com. So whatever's going to go best with your car, go on eTrailer.com and pick whatever fits you best. So we are going to have a little bit of added height to our Sorento. In this case, from our roof to the bottom of the bars is about three and a half inches and to the top about four and a quarter inches. It's always nice to know how much you add to the top of your vehicle just for those low clearance situations like a parking garage or whatever it may be. So let's just go ahead and install them right now. So the first thing we're going to want to do to get these feet installed is to screw on our T-Track. So the way we got to do that is we have a little tab here. We're going to pull that out take our tool and this screw on the inside there is going to be what holds this T-Track in place. So you want to get it somewhat threaded on but not too much because we still have to fit it into our T-Track. So once that's done make sure that this is facing out and slide her into place. We do need to set the right distance. There is a measuring tape here. So we do have our feet at a set point that we found in our instructions. And once we get it lined up properly, we can take that same exact screw that we use to install our T-Track and tighten that down. And with your tool, it will give you a click when it's torqued down properly. The next thing we want to do is fold open this little gray flap here and as you can see in there these teeth are going to slide into this so as we fold that in it's going to hook on to that up top and then we can go ahead and tighten that down a little bit and once we get it a little tight we can go ahead and click this back into place. So we're going to take our rubber boot. That arrow needs to be facing out. Snap that on. And then we can close this and replace our cap. So we are going to want to install our first our front bar first. We are going to have a measurement in our instructions to measure from the top edge of our glass to see where we're gonna put this first bar. Be sure to make sure everything is nice and tight and fits properly, and then you can go ahead and tighten it down and then continue with the back bar. So with our second bar, we are going to look in our instructions to find the distance between our front bar to the back bar so we can set those evenly. We do have them set in place properly, so we can go ahead and replace our caps. It's pretty easy. You just gotta fit them in like so, snap it into place, we don't have any locking cores on these right now, but they are available here at eTrailer.com. Well, thanks for tuning in and taking a look at our Yakima Jetstream roof rack system on our 2019 Kia Sorento.